No excuses. Look, we all start out in this thing called life exactly the same. Naked, scared, and ignorant. Sure, certain things happen to us. Things happen to all of us. But what happens to us doesn't define us. What we do about it does. Like it or not, you have 100% responsibility for your life. Everything that's going on in your life right now is your own dang fault. All of it, no matter what has happened. Hear me now. It is your fault. If you haven't achieved your dreams, it's your fault. If you are low on money, it is your fault. If you got divorced, it's your fault. If the relationship with your kids, coworkers, neighbors, or friends is tension-filled or less than loving, it's only your fault. If you are overweight, not where you wanted to be in your career, not joyful, not mentally and spiritually peaceful, don't have enough time, feel overwhelmed, overscheduled, and frazzled, say it after me. It's your fault. You did it. All of it. Remember this formula for owning 100% responsibility for your life going forward. All you have in life has been created by, one, what you did, two, oh, and this one people forget. Sometimes you have limited results in life not by what you did, but by what you didn't do. But you could have, you knew you should have, but still didn't. And that is why you have limited results. You didn't do what you knew you could have, thus, it's still your fault. Number three, or lastly, and this one is one that really trips people up. But Darren, what if you get hit by a bus or you're in a tsunami or fall off a horse and break your neck? Are you responsible for the bus hitting you or the tsunami? No, of course not. But you are responsible for how you respond to what happens to you. Thus, no matter whatever happens, no matter what your wife, boss, client, or competitor does, no matter whoever is president, what happens in Washington, in the economy, in other parts of the world, whatever difficulty you encounter, the outcome of your life is still your fault. Your dreams are your responsibility. The only variable factor to whether you conquer them is what? Say it with me. The only variable factor to whether you conquer your dreams is what? All together now. Yeah, you. Nothing else, no one else, no excuses. <laughs>